Hello everybody, this is Corker from Mexicali Fish Keeper. Hey, today um, is actually a pretty big uh, step in the direction that we wanted to go with this project at the museum. I'm um, right now, let me show you where I'm at. You probably got a clue by looking at the background, but let me turn the camera around. All right, today is a pretty big day of deal because um, we finally got that stand uh, set up and done. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and walk in here real quick and I can show you um, the outcome of that and then tomorrow uh, we'll be uh, we'll be setting up the aquarium actually escaping it and hopefully by the 29th we'll have all the, the livestock and everything in there hello ladies and uh, let me show you guys where it's good to, where it this is still kind of where we're gonna put it at but this is pretty much the stand and the top that we were working on to get on here and uh, hopefully tomorrow you guys will be able to see uh, the actual aquarium on top of that and we're going to go ahead and put in the plants and and do all the hardscape i have uh joe paris from the chlorophyll corner coming out coming down from tempe to help me scape uh this aquarium so hopefully you guys will have an update video for for tomorrow uh i'm still debating whether we're going to live stream that or what we're going to do that with that or i'm just doing a uh, footage on that if you guys actually want to see that live stream leave me a comment uh, based on what I see from the comments we can do something where it's either live stream or uh, I just do a video but either way just kind of want you guys to do a quick update and show you guys that and uh, we'll see we'll see how that looks later on thank you well that was it pretty much I was able to coordinate with them that tomorrow uh, this is Wednesday uh, talking about tomorrow Thursday uh, being able to come in and, and escape that also real quick before i forget i really want to say a, a a big big thank you to c shay especially jay wilson he's the one that's hooking us up with the filter for this aquarium um i know that was one of the key components that we were missing for that and uh thanks for them thanks to c shay for for helping us out and providing us with a with a filter for that aquarium so um Again, the people that were involved with this, I have to thank Joe Perez from the Chlorophyll Corner. They've been a big, big supporter from day one. As a matter of fact, he's the one that's gonna help me escape. Um, this aquarium, he's, he's actually been my co uh, collaborator on this project. So I wanna say thank you very much to uh, to Joe Perez. Also, uh, Keith from KG, KJE Aquatics. Why do I always have a hard time with that? <laughs> uh, He's also been a, a big supporter of this. He's the one that's provided uh, the food uh, for for this aquarium and the setup. And one of the very first pe persons to reach out to me um, to see if I needed anything. Also, Steve uh, from Warrior Planet Thanks. Uh, he's providing the livestock and going to be providing the plants for this. Um, I know the shipment that originally came. There was a little bit of hiccup on that, and. Um, He's turning around and he said he was gonna reship some of that stuff. So either way, he's the one that's um, pretty much gonna be doing all the livestock for that aquarium and be, you know, following up with some of the plants. Also, uh, a very special thank you to Fathom Aquatics. Again, he, he reached out and gave me a $100 gift card for aquarium co-op for any incidentals. Any of the stuff that we're going to need, which is really kind of come in handy because now I can figure out uh, with all of this stuff, once we start putting it together, there's always those last things that are needed, whether it's a light or whether it's uh, um, timers. I don't know. You know, a lot of stuff that uh, Aquarium Club has at hand that could really help out this project. So I want to say thank you to Alex. I want to make sure I'm not forgetting anybody else. KGE. Uh, yeah, I think that's everybody for right now. Uh, I I know a lot of people have offered to help, and I really appreciate that. And again, like I've said, this won't be the last opportunity to be able to get involved with a project like this. I just kind of wanted to keep it smaller numbers for this time around because it's a little bit easier to control and not having to wait on different people. Oh, and of course, my friend Charles. How can I forget that? He provided the 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 top for that uh, aquarium stand so and he also brought it into the to the museum he's the one that has that business out there in Tacna I think it's uh Sonora 
So know what a sawmill or something like that. I, I gotta, I really gotta get. I'll put a link. I'll put a. I'll put a link for all the people that were involved with this project, uh, so that you know you can go check them out and support them. You know, uh, support their content since they're supporting me with this. So with that being said, I want to say thank you. And tomorrow might be a live stream, might be a video. I'm not sure yet, based on what I get uh, the comments from you guys. So you guys take care. I'll see you guys soon.